welcome to java forum now i am going to show you how to install sales history sf schema in oracle database 19c enterprise edition so sales history schema is a very huge schema contains lot of uh, uh, data files that is lot of data to be uh, loaded in the table okay let us see so this is the oracle 19c home and this is the 19c base directories so let me go to oracle home uh, under oracle home demo schema okay so here only i have extracted all the uh, database sample schema database uh, 19.2 uh, sql scripts so already i extracted the sql script so among that i am going to install sales history schema okay so sales history schema contains lot of uh, data and sql files okay so sh under main.sql so sh under main.sql is the starting point of sales history schema insertion and also you can see that sub underscore cwd is replaced by absolute path okay make sure that you are replace the sub underscore cw string with absolute path and i am showing another example so here uh, in this query uh, that is uh, not down the sql uh, sql file so in this specific query i have uh, added one option read size okay so read size and provided one number so not down this so for buffer overflow or uh, out of memory issue i have added this uh, read size option okay so in case you did not uh, uh, get any issue means you can uh, ignore that okay now i have opened the sql plus sysas is tba show pdbs so you can see that oracl pdb in mounted state so i am altering the oracl pdb to uh, open and rewrite mode okay read write mode so make sure that you are uh, pluggable database in read write mode then only you can install schema so now you can see that oracl pdb in read write mode okay now okay now i am going to show you tns names dot ora file so here you can see that i have added the entry for oracl pdb pluggable database as service so what is the advantage is uh, i can able to log in to uh, pluggable database uh, in sql plus directly okay so that is advantage here and uh, if you touch the tns name that ora means you need to restart the uh, listener service okay oracle listener service stop and start the oracle listener service then only you can uh, enjoy the change okay then only you can uh, see the changes uh, take effect okay now in sql plus i am uh, login as a sys at oracl pdb as sdba okay now i am going to inst uh, install this sales history schema uh, which means that i am going to install sh underscore main dot sql sh underscore main dot sql so provide the parameters input parameters password for sh table space will be users temp table space will be temp and provide the password for sys specify the directory path for data files specify the writable directory path for log files specify the version so specify the connect string so here i am giving as oracl pdb localhost colon 1521 slash oracl pdb is also valid one so you can see lot of uh, 
values are loaded from external table it will take a little bit time yes so sales history schema installed uh, successfully so i did not see any issues i think uh, all the records from external tables are uh, got inserted successfully thousands of rows are there so all are got inserted i think Okay, now let me open the SQL Plus and log in as uh, DBA once again to pluggable database or cell PDB. So, alter user SH identify by SH account unlock. So now I am going to check in SQL developer. Yes, I can able to connect as a SH user uh, in SQL developer. So also I can able to browse the database objects, uh, tables and views. I can able to browse indexes. M views okay. Let me try one query. Yes, it's successful. Okay. So let me disconnect uh, from SQL Dopa. Let me try in Oracle SQL Plus. Yes, I can able to log in directly in uh, SQL Plus. Also able to browse the database objects and records. Okay, so finally, uh, sales history sample schema and search in Oracle database 19C enterprise edition is successful. Make sure that you replace the sub underscore CWD string with absolute path.